Now we come to spreading the slide. We start with a clean glass slide and a drop of blood. The drop of blood is placed close to one end of the slide. Now hold the spreader at approximately a 30 degree angle and move it smoothly to the other end of the slide. Holding the spreader at too great an angle or moving it too fast will create a short spread. Holding it at a low angle or spreading it slowly can create a long spread slide. There is nothing quite like a well spread slide. The problem of a short spread is that the film appears packed and there's not enough space to observe morphology properly. A long spread might even go off the edge of the glass and we're in danger of missing large or atypical cells. While it's important to know how to make a slide manually, you should also understand that some laboratories have an automated slide maker.